Hey guys, it is Shania from Shania Forever, and I am bringing you Mario Kart, Mario Brothers, but with the Go Girl experience. And so I am Mario Girl, and today we are moving. This is moving day, and I pray that it was easy and swift, and it has been thus far. So enjoy this video. You'll see how I just uh, do a, a cleaning, you know, post the cleaners already cleaning. Uh, just to make sure that the furniture is being laid down um, the way I would like it to be laid down because I actually did not know the cleaners. So it wasn't anything specific that I could request. So for my concoction, it has vinegar, pine salt, some other things, and then water. And um, so this video will consist of the cleaning uh, organization of a few things and just how I just go through things with a blank canvas before everything's moved in. So they're moving quickly. The movers, my husband and his cousin, they're moving swiftly and quickly. So it's like by the time I'm done with the, the you know, when I was done with the kids' bathroom, they had already brought everything for both of the kids' rooms. And so I organized Neely's with you guys on this video. Oh, she's when her bed is together, you'll be able to see like what I did before I did some like major decorating here. But of course, I'm just going to keep it calm in this place because I actually expect to move quite quickly uh, from being here. And I'm just thankful that we were able to move. We actually had a condition developing in our last place that had us moved. So this was kind of like I'm thankful that they accommodated us in the same living facility. But this is still not the end all be all. So. Uh, just watch how I take care of this place post or prior to everything being in here from just so far, guys. It is brush time right now because this is the only day that we have help. Someone's here to help us. So. So the sunlight will be 
be on her head in the morning, and then no, it won't be. it'll be on the back of her head. Or since we don't have that. Okay. Together. Y'all faster than me. I'm, I'm so excited. Okay. So they done got this in here already. So my shoe rack used to be by the door. And um, I'm just changing changing the layout of things okay guys yeah so the next time you guys see me doing this and I hope it's soon I really do I hope that this place is completely temporary in the name of Jesus and not in a bad way not where things went awry but because God's gonna bless somebody else with this place and we will have a bigger place because we need it um so as of right now, I am always thankful because we actually were coming from mold. We had to move because of mold. And a lot of people wouldn't be that honest. They wouldn't tell you that because they don't have to. Wipe everything with bleach wipes, but let me just mop first because they're moving fast. So, we had mold and um, you know people be trying to treat it. I even lived in this like spectacular townhouse before I had children and we had mold in the garage and they treated it. Now I don't know what the hell they treated it with because that it didn't come back. They treated our place and it just wasn't working. I actually, I actually know how boring a cleaning video can be. And so that's why I came to you in character. Um, because I wanna be able to watch my own video and be like, and tell my children to go watch that video. Do you get what I'm saying? And for kids to just be motivated to clean their home, you know what I mean? So just cleaning is therapeutic. You know, nobody knows what I've been going through behind the scenes. You know, you, I have to focus on the kids' schooling keeping their grades up. And then at the same time, I'm dealing with our living conditions, worried about it. Every day you're seeing another spot in the ceiling. And so just in case someone else is dealing with this, um, sometimes when you're, when you guys are like coughing, you just never know. It may not be what everybody thinks it is. It could sometimes be your home, shucks. You know, I was gonna do this live, but it's just, look at how everything's moving and the video probably would've been boring. I may give them a look, no, I just can't. It just won't be right. Can't get right. But tomorrow I have a collaboration 
So I will possibly, it'll be stupid for me not to go live at the collaboration because child, they be getting their work edited. <laughs> My work stands no chance against theirs. Like, so let me just get the behind the scenes. You know what I mean? That's the tea that I want to have. I want my videos. That's because that's all I can offer. Because their their stuff is edited, and I'm not doing that right now. I'll edit a travel video with my family, but um, right now my channel isn't really dedicated to what my collabors be doing. My collabors create fun content, dating content, and that's not. I just be on there as a contestant. And the, and being a contestant just gets me followers. They find my channel and then they be like, wait a minute, is she married? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, but y'all didn't get it. That's like a game show. It's like, it's like, it's like movies. Social media now is like movies. Y'all think the people in the movies are married? No. So same thing with when I do a collab. It's all for TV. <laughs> Enjoy the show. Enjoy the television. Because that's all it is, it's for fun. And I'm still at that ripe look. I'm not gonna say age. I'm, at, I'm still at that ripe look to do content like that. So when people be saying, wait a minute, she a mom and, yeah, but y'all ruining it for everybody else that's just enjoying the show. Shut up. Nobody cared that I was a mom and not the people that watch the show. People that's watching the show are just enjoying the, sh the, the dating show. You know what I mean? Y'all know what I'm saying. Because if you done made it over here and you subscribe to me, you're not one of those haters. That's like, wait a minute, she a mom? Why is she doing this content? Sir, this is television. Ma'am, this is television. <laughs> Did you ask Claire Hustable why she was kissing on Bill Cosby when she was married? No. And y'all better not go back and ask her. <laughs> I've been on start or something. Now everybody like, wait, Claire wasn't married to Bill? No, Claire Huxtable was not married to Bill Cosby. <laughs> I just realized that y'all were not on the floor with me on the tour to film. He just had them. But we change these doorknobs, but I don't think he's going to do it tonight. <sighs> but we be changing all of this stuff around the doorknobs and all of this fixture shit. <sighs> Look at that. So I'll do another video where you guys see the stuff that I got, the closet organizers and stuff like that, but wipe down this desk. But how are you guys doing today? Um, so the best thing for me to have done is to make sure that I film stuff before everything is done. And I just want to respect their spaces. I'm just going to just because he went over this that's why it's not so dusty he already went over this but the handles and stuff like that let me Let's clean this window seal child but his other stuff is not for show i actually think that you guys like when people your like your favorite youtubers make videos like this because you're like, oh, they're a person too. You know what I mean? They fold, they clean, you know what I mean? It's just, I'm just doing it in character and I'm so happy I am because the vibes would have just been lower because we're doing this with very little help. And you know how you know something's gonna happen but you have a hundred things going on and a hundred other stresses. That's what's going on in our lives. <laughs> So I'm just thankful that my mind is strong enough to now. And when they come, just come correct. Just give it a hundred million percent. Not not a hundred percent. A hundred percent no more is not good enough. Did y'all know that? 
Giving things 100% right now isn't even good enough. Y'all got to come with a hundo million percent. Can you imagine if people showed up to work with a hundred million percent? Oh my God, this world would be a better place. Imagine a doctor showing up to work, hundred million percent. They probably already do. I'm not talking to everybody. Your doctor, your nurse, your te the teachers, everybody that has a job shows up a hundred and fifty million percent. This world would be a better place. <laughs> Pharmacists, all of us, all of us, I pray to God, when y'all look at this video, nobody says, why she got on that outfit, why she doing that, but people say, damn, she got on the outfit, she even like sitting here, she got her baby in the living room, she, um, she holding shit down, and the lady, <laughs> I got a cleaning appointment tomorrow for my teeth, the lady has a life, and she's still holding it, and she's still sat here and put on a costume, <laughs> that's all I want y'all to take from this I don't want no one to feel bad for me because I had mold and I had to move I don't want nobody to to be mad that I came on here with a costume I want people to just be like yo this lady that came here she got a full life full schedule three children a husband a house it's Friday, so you know she just got paid. And she's here cleaning their their new place. And she chose to bring her bring us with her. And she put on a costume to make the video. And to make her husband smile. Because nobody's really smiling. Nobody is really happy that they have to move because of mold. We're happy that there was an outlet. We're happy that we were saved before like we ended up all on some, you know, medication. So are we thankful? Yes, but everybody, child, y'all know what I'm talking about. This isn't like, yay, we're ready. We bought our home. No, nah, this, this is not that. So everybody's, everybody's sad but happy in this, in this moment. We're sad, but happy. We know that we had to move because of health reasons. And we're happy that our area was able to, to accommodate us. And we're thankful that we left before things became harmfully obvious that our living conditions were dangerous. Do you get what I'm saying? So... I just want to I just want to say that just keep praying guys. I mean, I pray nonstop, but what I prayed for hasn't as far as living conditions hasn't happened yet, but it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. I probably needed to I just needed to probably shed some of that skin from that other place. I needed to shed some of the skin from the other place in order for me to get where I'm going. Can y'all believe that? Can I speak a word? Can I speak a word? I probably needed to shed some of that skin from the other location, y'all. You have to let go of stuff. Okay, so now we got bits and pieces. And I done sat here and made duffel bags of stuff I'm giving away. Ow! So, we have three more books I have to put there. I don't have that on the rack, correct? This is what happens when your mama doing your stuff. Uh, okay. Oh. So. Y'all know how long that's going to stay folded. Put it in the comments. <laughs> Easy part is the counter. I want a full length mirror on this wall, but I actually, I can wait y'all. I can wait until I...
you ready with it?